So I came down to the basement just for a moment so I could have a quick moment to myself. And just as I'm starting to record, someone found me. So she's requesting a hug. I'm going to give her a hug. And she's going to go right back upstairs. Mwah. All right. No, 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 no. What's that? What's that? Okay, crayons. Uh, leave those there, and you can go. Leave those there, and you can go back upstairs, and I'll be up in a moment, okay? And then we're gonna get ready to leave for the gym, okay? No, you just said you wanted a hug. Can you go back upstairs for me, please? I'll be right up. Okay. Um. Yes, we can snuggle just for a few minutes, but I'll come upstairs and we can snuggle, or I'll tell you when you can come back down, okay? Can you give me a moment of privacy, please? Okay, thank you. Can you go back upstairs for me, please? Yeah, the music is on. You want to watch videos, right? No, I just want a little bit of privacy. So can you go back upstairs and watch the music videos that you want to watch? You said you wanted to watch music videos. So can you go back upstairs and I'll be up there in a moment, okay? Watch where you're going. Turn around, watch where you're going. Emma, that's, you're playing on the stairs. Don't play on the stairs. Turn around and go upstairs, please. Good job. I'll be up in a second. Or several. I am cramping so bad. But I'm glad that it appears that my period, it, my, my cycle is starting. This month's cycle is starting. I call I sent a message to the nursing team to ask them if they wanted me to um oh if it's okay for me to take tranexamic acid tranexamic acid was prescribed to me by my gynecologist uh when um my fibroids were discovered so for about a year now I've been taking it and it really lightens and it really takes away a lot of the discomfort and I'm not flowing as heavy and my period has gone from like maybe five and a half days six days to like three and a half four days and um I'm not flowing nearly as much as I was before but since I don't want this to conflict with what we're trying to do, like with the lining or just the medication itself to interfere with the protocol. So I sent a message just to be clear, you know, hey, is this a conflict? Is it not? I mean, I'll deal with the discomfort. I am clear to take Tylenol. But this discomfort that's hitting me right now is so worthy of a Tylenol. But I'm going to try and hold out. Um, just to see, um, if they tell me that I cannot take the tranexamic acid, I'm definitely going to need some Tylenol. Um, I just needed a moment. Oh my God. I needed a moment. Oh God. Oh God. The loss of the baby, the end baby, is really affecting me now. That hurt me so bad yesterday. I had a couple of triggers and I didn't see it coming. And then after I had my appointment with my psychotherapist, it was good to like vent and get some stuff out and talk about what bothered me about um, um, a couple people who have not followed up with me and some tones of some conversations that I had. <sighs> Excuse me. I guess reliving those conversations bothered me and set off another trigger, I was already having a hormonal mood swing. And by the time I got home, I 
was just sad and hurt. And I just, I almost feel like I reverted. And it's like, no, we're having a good day. This is not going to happen. Everything is fine. Things are going to be fine. I just, every damn day, oh God, every day is a struggle. And sometimes the struggle is minimal, and sometimes the struggle is huge. Sometimes there's no struggle at all, but I'd rather be struggle-free and having a light-free day excuse me, then to be feeling so heavy or just hit, you know, just blindsided with some pain. <sighs> that progesterone definitely kept me on some swole shit. I didn't necessarily like it. But now that I'm off, it's like I'm so freaking... Such a freaking softy and sensitive. Oh, gosh. I lost a baby. It was a living thing. I took a lot of comfort in the Lord last night. It's, and that's when it's really great to have a relationship with a higher power. Higher power meaning whatever you apply it to. Um, I just took myself back to what I knew was comforting. And it worked. It was It was comforting. But it was still just so very sad. But I've got to get myself in gear for the kids. Um, we've got gymnastics in about an hour. <sighs> and I've got a couple of orders to ship out today. So I've got some things to keep me occupied, but I'm hurting now both physically and my heart I'm sad I'm just sad I'm so sad I didn't want to come to work today I'll make something of it <sighs> 